What's up YouTube fam? Welcome back to a new video. In this video, I'm going to be showing you guys some fall fashion outfit ideas. Recently, I've been collecting some staple pieces that I think are great for the transitioning season from summer to fall. What's great about fall is that it's not too cold and it's also not as warm. Right now where I'm at it's still 80 degrees so I was a trooper and put on some of these warmer clothes for you guys just to give you some ideas of what you might want to wear for fall. I like to switch things up, I like to be a little different and I like to add a little flavor to the outfit and stuff. Thank you guys so much for watching, thank you always for your support and if you're keeping up with my podcast Make sure to let me know in the comment section below so I can give you a shout out at the beginning of my video. Also, don't forget to turn on the notification bell button and subscribe if you haven't already to be the first to see when I upload and post next. So, I hope you guys like it and I'll catch you guys in the next video. Bye guys! With my first fall look, I'm wearing this long sleeve bodycon dress from Windsor paired with a double buckle belt from H&M and some ankle booties from Rhapsodeal. I think this is one of the best colors to wear for fall. The dress really complements the figure while keeping you warm and leaving room to show off some leg. This is super cute for a going out look. To style and add a nice touch, I paired this black fringe purse I got off of eBay years ago. It was only $10. I think it really adds to the outfit matching with the belt and a bit of a modernized western vibe. This is one of my favorite purses I own and I always get really great compliments on it when I wear it out. I could not wait to share this one with you guys. So this is a jumpsuit from H&M I got for $20 and paired with these knee-high boots I'm wearing underneath from Forever 21. I'm a huge fan of jumpsuits and never had one in this color and in this design yet, so I absolutely had to have it. I think this olive green color is perfect for fall as the darker colors are making their appearance. I like that this jumpsuit can be styled up or down, it's very fashion forward and has a nice street vibe to it. I also like pairing these with my Adidas Superstars when I'm going out for a comfier dress down look. I love that there is a waist belt that really cinches in at the waist. It's a very simple but a go-to statement outfit. I love looks where you don't have to try too hard to dress up and that are also comfy when you're going about your day. Cue the annoying person that's showing off their new bag. <laughs> So I not only love the color and simple design of the bag, but I love it even more that it was on sale at TJ Maxx for 12 bucks. It's a small handbag that also turns into a shoulder bag with an attached chain hidden inside. If I'm being honest, when I head out, I hate carrying too many things, so this is the perfect size for just the necessities. Next fall look is a 
white turtleneck tucked into a corduroy button skirt with some ankle booties. I feel like corduroy is such a staple style for fall, whether it be skirts or overalls. By the way, if you happen to catch it, I did have to pin this because I struggle with finding bottoms that also fit my waist even when it is the right size. So my turtleneck, skirt, and boots are from Rhapsodeal, but there's so many places you can find the same if not similar look. Again, keeping it super simple but also stylish as possible. By the way, I honestly don't care how ridiculous my dance moves are, as long as my puppy is happy, that's all that matters. To style, I did add this shoulder bag from H&M. I like that with any of these colors, they all match perfectly, so it really doesn't matter how you style them in what order, because they really coordinate well together. I feel like this is such a cute everyday look that doesn't require much effort and if it is colder you can always layer with a jacket or coat and even add leggings or pantyhose underneath the skirt. By the way, I do apologize I didn't change my earrings throughout the video because I ended up losing a pair and also breaking one, so this is just what we were working with, but I also love an excuse to bring out the hoop. So I know what you're thinking, how do you wear this in fall? Well, not everywhere in the world is freezing cold during this time of year, so I thought this would be a great transitional season outfit. I'm wearing these bell bottoms or flare jeans from Windsor with a cropped halter bell sleeve blouse and wedges. I am a huge fan of bell bottoms, so an excuse to wear them I will use to my absolute advantage. I really loved the unique design of the blouse and it gives me major vintage hippie vibes. My wedges are also from Windsor and I highly recommend wedges for being the comfiest and easiest type of shoes with added height to walk in. I also love the bow in the back that adds a pop of color, it really stands out and overall makes the outfit come together. If you prefer boots, you can also add some ankle boots or any style boots that would also complement the look as well. Thank you guys so much for watching and let me know what you're looking forward to seeing next in the comment section below and I'll catch you guys in the next video.